Hello, care about to Sim Rally. This is a update on the. Uh, I would. This is an update on the Road to Real Rally series that I had going. Um, I uh, hold on. That's all, right, mate. Let's go. Uh, Woody wants to get involved as well. Um, yeah. So on the last video, I went or the last, the first episode of this series, I uh. I'd passed my bars test. Um, I said there was going to be like a bit of a wait uh, before I got myself a car and stuff like that. Um, so from then over Christmas and sort of through January, I was looking at cars and what cars to get. And I ended up coming across this Ford Puma on eBay. Uh, I think it was on for 2800 and I managed to get it for 2200 um so this is this is like a nice little beast of a car so i went to pick it up on saturday uh the guy who sold it to me was like really a really cool guy uh, he's done like quite a few events he's been rallying it for two years um he's done a bit of work on it like how you going dog um he's done like a bit of work on it sort of He's remapped the ECU, he's done something to the cams, he's bored out the inlet manifold as well, so the inlet manifold matches, there's no lip, so it gets like more air in. Uh, it's got sports suspension on the rear, uh, on the front. Um, I think it's got standard suspension on the rear. We did have sports suspension on it, but he said that he couldn't get the characteristics right that actually work better with what he put on um so it's got like quite a few little battle scars on it um see like the tape on the bumper yeah tape on the bumper and stuff um what i'll probably do is he sort of made these plastic windows himself but you can see the kind of deteriorating a little bit um i've already uh, broke it by trying to pull the door shut by one <laughs> so i'll probably replace them apart from that i could turn up to an event in this tomorrow all the seats are in date the harnesses are in date uh, fire extinguishers are all in date um i think it's mot till march or april or something like that uh, so i could turn up and rally this tomorrow um which I really want to do. <laughs> I love the smaller wheels as well. I think the wheels are off like a Mark II Escort, but because the wheels are smaller, it's smaller tyres, that's going to save me a bit of money in tyres as well. I should be able to get them cheaper. Um, yeah, These are just a couple of little pictures I took, took when I picked it up. Uh, it's got a hydro handbrake. Um, it's got a twister for the brake balance so I can sort the brake bias out front and rear. Uh, say it looks tatty but for 2200 quid that's kind of i wanted something a bit battered so i'm not scared to actually give it a good welly when it when i start doing events i want something i'm not not scared of scratching or damaging uh, which is what that'll be that's that's absolutely perfect for what, what i wanted um i think this is a little video i took as well in the walking yard yeah so say it like a little bit battered but video doesn't do it justice but it sounds actually really nice um, yeah yeah so I'm, uh, I'm excited to get it out uh, I need some more wheels. He was going to give me some spare wheels, but they were cracked, so he's going to keep them, uh, sort of do something with them himself. So I'm going to have to get some new 13 inch wheels just as spares for when I do events. Um, get some tyres, give me a load of tyres as well. Uh, oh, I, mean, I might have to change the steering wheel because I want to I wanna play the steering wheel. Probably got like a nice Sparco one, fire extinguishers all plumbed in and stuff. Um, I think it's done like 100,000 miles or something like that, but the engine has been out. 
there it is in his bag. I got a, a shit ton of parts as well. Like three boxes. Three, uh, two big boxes full of parts and then uh, two little boxes with like hubs and brackets and all sorts of little joints and stuff in. Um, got a gearbox, a radiator, a steering rack, uh, loads of tyres. Um, so nice, nice amount of parts that he, he sorted for me as well, which it was like made up with. Uh, so does I can afford to have a couple of little bumps in it uh, and not have to worry. Uh, that's just it, waiting now for change the stickers, see if I can get some sponsors on it myself. It obviously change uh, the, the names on it and get my own name on there. So it's a couple of little tidying up bits. Uh, that's actually my mate's uh, Drift and Beamer. There's an app. That's tidy stuff. Yeah, so I just wanted an update. I'm thinking maybe... I was thinking summer, June, July, but now I've got that car sitting there. I just need to get it out. I need to get rallying in it. I might do a track day. Uh, gonna get a, I've got to sort myself out next. So I've got to get a helmet, hands device, um, intercoms, gloves, overalls, boots. So I think gloves and overalls, gloves and boots don't have to be FIA. It just, in the blue book, it says that they highly recommend FIA. So I can go a little bit cheaper on the gloves and stuff if I want. Um, but I'll probably get a cheap pair of FIA approved. So maybe starting around 70 quid or something like that. Overalls are probably going to cost me 200, 300 quid or something like that. Um, so yeah, it's I've got to get all this other stuff now. Obviously I've just sank a load of my wages just buying the car. So, but I'm just going to... I'm just going to go into my overdraft to get myself kitted up and then I know exactly where I am. And then it's just a case of being able to build the, the money back up to do an event. Um, so yeah, just a little update. There she is. Um, just waiting now. Waiting to be driven. Uh, I can't wait. I absolutely can't wait. So, give it a nice little blast and it, it picks up. It really does pick up. Uh, he's sorted the gearbox out so there's no fifth gear there's only four gears and it just keeps on pulling like first and second um, so yeah that, that's where we are we're a big step closer to getting out and doing a real rally so yeah update uh, and then the next video I'll probably do once I've bought all the safety gear and then I'll do a breakdown of cost of how much it's cost me to get to the point where I've got everything and I'm ready to go and do a rally. Um, I'll list everything. Of, uh, I'll list the full price then. Uh, so you sort of know how much about it's costing me. Um, but yeah, that's that one for now. Don't forget like, subscribe, hit the bell for the notifications. And I'll see you on the next video. <laughs>